Hi, this is Sandro Forte. Now, if you are a regular subscriber to this channel, you will know that periodically I review the odd book. One that's maybe had an impact on my life, maybe that's had an impact on the lives of others that I've come across along the way. Certainly those that have really contributed either to society, to business, or in some way, personally or professionally. Now, I'm gonna share a book with you today that has a particular importance to me personally. Not only is it an amazing book, but there is a story behind it. I want to share with you that story, if I may, just briefly, because if I take you back to 2019, which is the year in which I started the Sandro Forte podcast, I was talking every week to a well-known sports person, celebrity, even a member of a royal family. And these had predominantly come from my own client bank, because as I was meeting with my clients, they were sharing all kinds of anecdotes about success and failure and overcoming all the challenges in life and business. And I decided to put those onto a podcast series, which ran for over three years. About six or seven weeks in, I was introduced to a young lady. We had several phone calls. She was very nervous about being a podcast guest. In fact, she was so nervous, she is the only podcast guest on the Sandro Forte podcast that has ever used a pseudonym. And part of the reason why she used a pseudonym, apart from being a nervous guest, was the fact that she had suffered for the whole of her life from a very debilitating illness called anorexia. Some of you, of course, will have heard of it, but you may not necessarily know of its effects and the impact it has on those that suffer from it, and in particular, those that are near and dear to the individuals who battle with this terrible illness. Now, we had a very, very enlightening conversation on that podcast, and since then, Chloe, that was her pseudonym, has now uh, decided that she's going to face the world, this lovely lady that has become a very, very close friend of mine, Claire Plasco. During the course of our conversations, subsequent to the podcast, we had conversations every single week and I encouraged her to share her story in a book. And I'm extremely proud of the fact, I take no credit for this, by the way, other than the fact that throughout our weekend conversations that lasted a year and a half, I really cajoled her, pushed her along, and every single word that she put into a book that she has called Understanding Me, and this is what it looks like, it's only just been published, so you will be one of the first to get a copy if you'd like to purchase one. Um, this book is an amazing, harrowing at times, really honest, very soul-searching, uplifting. It took me in a 100 different emotional directions, but what, most of all, one of the things that it has done is shone a light on my life. It's put a lot into perspective. Uh, it is an amazing book that has been built, constructed, written word for word by Claire. And I'm incredibly proud of everything that she's achieved, not least because she still battles anorexia on a daily basis uh, and always will. She has had, you know, a colourful life. She's dealt with some demons along the way but fundamentally she is a beautiful person and I'm really, really proud to call her my friend as well. So if you get the chance, if you are the sort of person who can find you know, a few hours to read a book, um, read this one, Understanding Me by Claire Plaskow, but I will personally ensure she uh, writes a note to you if you want to include your details when you place your order, we'll take care of that for you and, we, and of course we'll ship it from, um, from the UK. So Claire Plaskow, Great job uh, to you and to all that you stand for. Well done. And to all of those of you listening, uh, please do get hold of a copy of this amazing book, Understanding Me by Claire Plasco.